So it's Friday. Doesn't make a whole lot of a difference. I'll be working tomorrow. I'll be working the day after tomorrow. There's some people that go through the week waiting until Friday. Right? Going through the week. I, is it Friday yet? Is it Friday yet? Waiting for Friday. Waiting for TGIF. So what that means is that Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, four days out of their life are wasted. They've gone through the day. Idled. Not created anything. And waiting for today to party tonight and party tomorrow and be hungover tomorrow and be hungover the following day. Ain't that sad? Here at the office, just finalized my appointment with a borrower that is self-employed and I've met this particular borrower for a good, this is gonna be my third time. And um, something really, really cool just happened, right? So after having finalized all the numbers, after having gone over the, her 2017 taxes and her projected income for 2000, or actually the income she closed out 2018 with, she is gonna qualify. Here's the cool thing about this. In 2017, roughly, she had made about $17,000 net. 2018, she killed it, had a great year. I think she netted about $80,000, dollars Okay? Um, so, the, so, and so she decided that she wants to refinance her property and she wants to cash out. Refinancing, cashing out $100,000, Nothing but great things on this loan. Number one, she's cashing out $100,000. That money is tax-free. Number two, her payment's only going up $300. Number three, the loan has been approved using one year's worth of tax returns. In other words, we're only gonna use the income she filed for 2018. Nobody else can do that for you. I can do that for you. If you're self-employed and you've thought about buying a house this year or the following year before you file your taxes, I suggest you... Great music, Claudia! I suggest that you reach out to me so that we can drill down exactly where you stand and what the numbers will look like in terms of what, what purchase price, what price range you would be based on um, your new or the income or the stellar year you had last year. This is not open house. Yep. This is a house. This is an open house. Look, the door's open. So I'm taking Alita to the open house. I went out, I went to lunch and I brought Alita with me. So this is her first time checking out an open house. Let's go check it out, Alita. Tell me if you like this house, okay? Is this open house? Yeah, come on in. Come on in. Let's go check it out. Let's go check out the other bedrooms. Come on. Wow, look at this bathroom. It is lovely. Look at this bedroom. Um, this one is my bed. Your bedroom? Okay. Look at this one. Wow, nice. Okay, this one's fine. Has a nice closet. Uh huh. Oh, wow. Look at this. Look at this big backyard, Alita. <laughs> would you buy this house? Yes. Yes? Uh -huh. Yeah, would you live here? Yes. Yeah. Hey, by the way, have you been pre-approved already? Uh -huh. You haven't been pre-approved? Yeah. And you're looking for homes already? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. So I can't believe you haven't been pre-approved. <laughs> Why are you shopping for homes and not pre-approved yet? Huh? I am. Why are you shopping for homes and not pre-approved yet? Don't do what Alita did. Go out looking at open houses, not being pre-approved. Do you even know what your mortgage payment's gonna be? You do not know what your mortgage payment's gonna be. And find out if the property uh, you're buying allows for dinosaurs as pets. Back here at the office, and as I'm pulling up to the office, I start to call out Alita, and look at what I realized. 
Pobrecita, she's asleep. Aleida, wake up, mama. Aleida, let's go. It, hey, man. It ain't easy being with JT, man. We go hard, man. We go hard. Back here at the office. Team still flossing. Their JTL t shirts. Subtle flexing over there. Look who visited us today. What's up, my man? What's going on, guys? What's happening, dude? Just here checking out JT Lendy team. It's good to have you, getting man. Some, getting some deals closed. Good to have you over here, dude. Yes, sir. Yes. Starting everything. So it's Friday. It is 7:30. 7:30 p.m. Done for the day, guys. Let's go. Let's go home. Spend some time with the fam. So yeah, very good day today. Accomplished a lot. Did everything I needed to do. And um, all is well.